Hi, I'm Y. Saramesh. And I'm Leslie Salazar. This is the Penn State Today Quickcast. Nearly 600 faculty and staff members have accepted the early retirement package offered by the university this fall. That's just under half of those who were eligible for the program. The first group of early retirees will leave Penn State in December. The others will retire next June. The university will pay about $67 million in compensation to those who are leaving. The Penn State Senior Class Gift Committee has announced the 2017 class gift after seniors voted. The winner, permanent annual funding for the Lions Pantry Food Bank, which provides free food to students who may be struggling financially. The campaign's director of student outreach says the endowment will help ease the burden for some students. I know there's some students who aren't necessarily poor, but just, you know, they have to pay rent or have to get textbooks, which cost 200 at times. So, you know, they don't have a meal plan. They're on campus and they're hungry. So Lion Pantry provides that for students. And Lions Pantry can always use your help. If you would like to make a donation, you can do that online on their website. Students just wrapped up the final Thon Canning Weekend across the region to fundraise for the Penn State Dance Marathon. Thon is set for February 17th through the 19th. Canning is just one of the ways students raise money, but it's being phased out after a crash killed a student last year. There will be only one more Canning Weekend next fall for Thon 2018 before it ends. New safety rules and free transportation options went into effect after last year's tragedy. Now Halloween festivities, haunted houses, and spooky sites are wrapping up, but a creepy presence lingers throughout the year in Penn State Schwab Auditorium. Now legend has it a friendly spirit affectionately referred to by the Penn State thespians as Schwabo occupies the theater. Halloween doesn't really make a difference. It's just the people, you know, everyone is like, oh, Schwabo, Halloween time, let's see what happens. We're like, Schwabo's here all the time. Scary stuff. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That's all for this Penn State Today Quickcast. Now for more, go to our website, commedia.psu.edu to see student-produced news from the College of Communications. Have a great day.